Good morning, good morning, good morning. Can you tell that the first day of summer is upon us? And we have red, white, and blue. We have all kinds of things that remind you of summer. We have something that reminds me of my favorite summers because I was a young child visiting my grandmother every single summer. And today, Miss Zanna is starring on the program. Nobody will care what Sherry says or does. Everybody will be focused on baby Zanna. And I can tell you, baby Zanna loves blueberries. Loves blueberries. Zanna, you want another blueberry, sweetie? There you go. She loves blueberries, and we're going to be feeding her. We're going to be testing her. We're going to be doing taste and texture today because I'm going to do some recipes that she will absolutely love. I'm going to do a recipe that she will spit out, and we're going to share when you're teaching your child to eat and you want to eat healthy, her mom is on a vegetarian thing and she's really eating healthy and doing everything good. Well, Zanna's like her nanny. Give me a sugar cookie. <laughs> Give me some cream cheese. But the great thing is cream cheese is not bad for you. You can do a keto-friendly diet with cream cheese. Is that not the coolest thing ever? So we're going to share some of Ansley's breakfast recipes, which happen to have um, avocado, onions, tomatoes, and a keto-friendly little zero, duh, which is cool because it gives it a little bit of texture and it gives it taste and it gives it flavor. It's great, but you can also take that. And for baby Zanna who loves blueberries, you can put some cream cheese and some blueberries on it. So we're gonna talk about that. But we're gonna talk a lot today about how important it is to get your grandchildren in the kitchen with you. Summer is the perfect time to do this. And so I have prepared a, a crust for a Americana pizza. And we're gonna start right now. I'm gonna, I wish Zanna could help me. Honey, I wish you were big enough to help because we're gonna be coating this crust with a spurtle. We're gonna just cover the crust and we're gonna make a cookie pizza that looks like an Americana flag. And then we're gonna let Zanna dig into it and make a mess because that's what you do. When you have great grandkids, you spoil them rotten. You don't make them mine like you did their mom and daddy. Oh, we didn't make their mom and daddy mine either now that I think about it. But this is a combination of a little bit of powdered sugar and cream cheese and Cool Whip. And we are making the base for the American flag. And it's very, very simple. And I love the flavors. I love blueberries, love strawberries, and Zanna does too. And you can kind of see how the base is looking. I started with just my cookie crust. So we're, we're looking at that. And then we are gonna make it look like a flag. And then we are going to let Zanna dig into it. And once she digs into it, it will probably be self-destruction. But I'm gonna do it really quickly with fresh blueberries, and blueberries are in right now. Now, Ansley, does Anna love blueberries? Absolutely. Does she love strawberries too? Uh, yeah, we eat blueberries every day. Blueberries every day, strawberries every day when they're available. Now, let's talk about what she did when we tried avocado in her mouth the first time. Mm, yes, she didn't enjoy that at all. She did not enjoy that at all, but <laughs> we're gonna test it today on TV because we're gonna share with you, you can make your children Either eat healthy or you can teach them to eat junk and it's up to you mom and um, I'm proud to say out of all the um, one of the few things that I succeeded at is my kids love vegetables. They love broccoli. They love green beans. They love um, carrots. They love beets. They love eating healthy because that's how we ate at home. That's how we ate. So and Ansley, I wish you were here to do this flag for me. <laughs> but she's sitting offset to control Zanna because we're afraid if mommy were up here, Zanna would probably be flipping out. So we're going to try to do this flag as quickly as I can. And I will tell you, it is so yummy, so good. I started with a sugar cookie recipe and did the um, base. And then we did the cream cheese and a little bit of powdered sugar and then Cool Whip. And it's very simple. It's very light, it's a very good dessert, and you can kind of see how it's coming together. It's beginning to look like a flag, and that's the whole point to no, this. No, no. Now, Santa is wanting to jump out of the chair, and we're trying to keep <laughs> her from doing that because that's why Mommy's sitting so close to her. It doesn't have a safety belt on it. You know, Ansley, let's talk about growing up. In my era, there was no such thing as a car seat. Now you belt her in everywhere you go, right? 
Yes. Yes, absolutely. Safety is so important. And, you know, back in the olden days, there was no such thing as a car seat. I don't know who invented it, but I bet you a lot of moms are happy that he did because it keeps our babies safe. So, now this is one of those things. Mama Lucy and I made one of these years and years ago. And, Ansley, you loved Mama Lucy, didn't you? Mm hmm Y'all traveled together and had so much fun. We went parasailing. They went parasailing, yes. Yeah. Now, can you imagine your nanny out in the middle of the ocean doing that? There is no way in the world. But Mama Lucy, Lucy was, a... Lucy was what, 70-something years old? Yeah, definitely. And she loved it. She loved it. Yeah. So, And we went up as high as it would go. Oh, my gosh. I can imagine her doing that. Oh, yeah. yeah. And yeah. she did it. No questions. No questions, yeah. She was so cool. So cool. Now, here we are, we're almost finished with the flag, and how simple was that? How simple was that? How easy is this? And it is something that your grandkids can come in and help you do. You make the cookie base and you do that, you let it cool, chill it, and then you add your cream cheese, and it is so, so yummy and so, so simple. Now, <laughs> we so are funny. going to give Xana a mini, <laughs> look at, Y'all are gonna get to focus on Xana now because we're gonna give her something. We're gonna give her a mini flag cookie uh -oh. that has strawberry. It's gonna have strawberry and blueberry in it. And we're gonna see if she picks off the blueberries, picks off the strawberries, or if she just digs in and eats it. So, Ansley, you're gonna have to control this. Okay, bite? You wanna bite? You wanna bite? You wanna try that? Let's put it in your high chair. Okay, you wanna try that? What is that? What is that? We're teaching you texture. Look, you can put your finger in it. Look. Look. Oh, boy. You want to taste it? Mmm. <gasps> Isn't that yummy? Oh, my gosh. It's so good. You want to do it again? Did you like that? Oh, I love that. So, y'all, this is cream cheese. Cool Whip. Is that not yummy, yummy, yummy? Is it as good as going to the Waffle House? Y'all, she is the queen of the <laughs> Waffle House. The Bob Brown Waffle House needs to get a trophy for her because this baby is so in love with the Waffle House. Is that good? Yum! <gasps> so the texture, you love it. That is so cool. Uh-oh. <laughs> she just spit it out. <laughs> okay, that's the first blueberry you've ever spit out. So did you spit it out because you didn't like the cream cheese? Who knows? Bye-bye. Uh -huh. Okay, you're going to eat it? You're going to keep on trying until you eat it? You can put your fingers in it if you want to. Make a mess. You can do it. We're going to let you. Yeah, we got wipes. That's what stuff. it's all about. We have wipes. Get your kids in the kitchen. Do something fun with your kids. Look at look at how she reacts to food. She's She loves trying stuff. She loves texture. Now, the one thing she does not like, and we have proven this in the past, and I'm going to cut up a few tiny pieces because she does not like avocados. But we're gonna try it and we're gonna prove a point. It's healthy, it's good. Now, Ansley, why do you eat it? It's low fat or it's good it's fat? It's high fat, yeah. It's high fat, but it's, it's healthy good fat. fats, yeah. yeah. It's healthy fat. So we're gonna prove that Xana does not like avocados. Now, I think my crew uh, likes avocados. Look at this, now we're making a mess. This is about texture. Okay, here you go. I want you to try this. I bet you won't do it. You want to try one? What do you think? She didn't spit it out. The well, last time she spit it out something awful. Maybe it's because I cut it in tiny pieces. She's eating avocado. I can't <laughs> believe it. Oh my gosh. Get Are her on camera. <laughs> it's because the nation is watching. <laughs> oh, I love that. So you're eating something that's healthy and good for you. Oh, Aunt Vicky will be so happy because Aunt Vicky is a avocado queen. So she's Ansley, she's eating it. I can't believe this, y'all. We were we were certain that she would spit it out all over TV. I can't believe this. The kid <laughs> made us a liar. She made us liars. That is funny. <laughs> that is so funny. Look at this. She is loving that. Now, how's she going to get into that cookie? Try it, baby. Bye. How's she going to get into teeth? <laughs> you going to do it with your toothies? Huh? Can you do it? Here, let's break it. There you go. We break it in half. It'll be easier for you, maybe. There you go. Now, <laughs> can you try that? Mmm, 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 mmm. Like some strawberries. Yum. Is that good? Oh boy, 
Y'all can tell. She's been in the kitchen before. She she watches her mom cook. Yeah. She knows what's going on. Get your kids in the kitchen. Do things with them that teach them creativity. Do things with them that, that remind them of their grandmother. Now, I'm going to play a trick on her because it's a sweet trick, though, and she will love this. This is marshmallow cream. Now, anybody who knows me knows my recipe for sweet potatoes. I bake the sweet potatoes. I use four jars of this. I use a half a jar of honey, <clears throat> and I use a stick of butter and brown sugar, and that's how I make sweet potatoes. But today, for Zanna, we are going to give her, look at this, it's sticky. Now, we're going to see how you react to that. What do you think? Did you like that? Not so sure. Not so sure. Texture, food is about texture. And your kids will either react to loving it. Now, <laughs> that was funny. Uh -oh. oh my gosh. <laughs> she loves corn on the cob, and that is texture. And she will eat a whole corn on the cob if oh, you yeah. don't stop her. <laughs> oh, yeah. And then the next morning we have a little bit of a diaper problem. She yeah. can't figure that out. Yeah, right there. yeah, yeah, yeah. I look at this. <laughs> She's loving it. She is loving it. Get in the kitchen with your kids. Get in the kitchen with your grandkids. Get some simple recipes and spend the summer teaching them, loving them, spending time sharing moments and memories because you can never recapture those. When I look back in the kitchen with my grandmother, I, all I can think about is JFG mayonnaise, bologna, and granny making a sandwich out of it, and me going, JFG? But those moments are, are amazing, and you would never want to lose those moments. So this summer, as we approach summer, as we approach the holidays, make a plan to get in the kitchen with your grandchildren. Do something fun with them. Teach them to learn. Look at this. Her favorite thing's the kiki. Of course it is. But she ate the avocado. Is that not the coolest thing ever? I'm so surprised. Maybe it's because I offered it to her in tiny pieces this time instead of a chunk. So she liked it and she ate it. So it's all about the texture. And remember, this recipe is truly so simple. And um, I did the cheese, the Cool Whip, a little bit of powdered sugar. I had to stop and think about that. Powdered sugar. I brought the regular sugar, but I used the powdered sugar. So again, it's something fun and easy that your grandkids can do, and they will love doing that. We're going to take a commercial break, and we're going to share a little bit of music with y'all. And when we come back, we're going to talk a little bit more about what it's like to be I'm a very young great-grandmother, very young, but it's fun to be a great-granny, and we'll share stories about that when we come back. I say, hey, good-looking, what you got cooking? How's about cooking something up with me? Don't you think maybe we could find us a brand new recipe? I got a hot rod Ford and a two dollar bill And I know a spot right over the hill There's soda pop and the dancing's free So if you wanna have fun come along with me
You're in the mood for chicken strips, a delicious burger, our classic banana split, or an upside down thick blizzard treat? We've got you covered. Hot and fresh food every day, every time. And delicious DQ soft serve make the perfect pair at your favorite place. Not fast food, fan food fast. Your Blue Ridge, Ella Day, and Jasper Dairy Queens are your meet, eat, and treat headquarters. Thank you for choosing DQ. How may I serve you? The mountains are calling and they're closer than you think. Farmers Crossing in Ball Ground offers creekside lots with homes beginning in the 400s. Walking distance to downtown shopping, dining, tennis courts, Calvin Farmer Park, and local events. It also includes a beautiful hike to Long Swamp Creek. Leave the car and the worries behind. Move in by fall 2023. Call Sherry Martin at 404-375-0590 or Evelyn Calhoun at 770-733-0779. Georgia Medical Treatment Center now has two locations to bring you the high quality holistic care you've come to know and expect. We treat neck, back, and joint pain with chiropractic care and injection-based treatment without the need for surgery or prescription painkillers. Our medical weight loss program can also provide relief while ridding your body of toxins, pounds, and inches while improving your overall health. Call today for a free consultation, 770-345-2000, or go online to georgiamtc.com. Hi, I'm Ryan Blaney, a third-generation race car driver, and we dedicate a lot of our time to going as fast as possible. But when my grandpa was diagnosed with Alzheimer's, it was a very unexpected bump in the road for us. It's important to notice if older family members are acting differently, experiencing problems with their memory, or having trouble with routine tasks. Early detection of Alzheimer's can give your family time to explore support services, make a plan for the future, and access available treatments. If you or your family are noticing changes, it could be Alzheimer's. Talk about seeing a doctor together. Whether you're swimming in the sea or splashing in the pool, making a masterpiece or just making memories, writing a great American novel or writing your term paper that's due tomorrow, Whatever you do in life, Farmers is here to protect it. For all your insurance needs, call Donald Curtis in Blue Ridge. preparing Zanna a healthy breakfast. Nanny just blew it when I did all the sugar we just did. But her favorite, Ansley, was it the marshmallow cream? For sure. Probably. She just, y'all, it's all over her face. It's everywhere. But this is this little mini. Now, is this zero carbs? Mm hmm Okay, a zero carb. What do you call these things? Tortilla shells? Tortilla, yeah. Tortilla shells. Okay. And then we would put some strawberries on it. It has the cream cheese, and I used a cream cheese spread that's easy to put together. And then you basically make yourself a mini sandwich, and then you fill in with blueberries. And so we're getting antioxidants. We're getting a little sweetness from the natural strawberries. And is this what y'all do for breakfast pretty much? Sometimes, yep. Yeah, and then you just fold it over. And so if you've got your grandkids there and they like these little shells, how cool is that? How easy, how simple is that? Mm -hmm. Now, will you eat this one? Yeah. Okay, let's, all right, there's Ansley's breakfast. Yay. There you go. And now, we're going to do a test with Zanna. We're going to see if Zanna can make a puzzle out of, okay, look at this. We're going to try, let's put one there and one there, and then I'm going to give her pieces and see if she will put it on the puzzle. You want to put it on the puzzle or you want to eat it? What do you want to do? So I want to eat it, of course, Nanny. I just want to eat it. Do you want to put some on the puzzle? No. 
say, no, I don't. I just want to eat it. So at 10 months old, we have proven all she cares about is eating. She is not mm. interested in creating anything. But look, Ansley, she loves the strawberries too. Mm -hmm. How cool is that? I like fruit. Oh boy, and it's so good for you. Oh, and it's making a mess and mommy's gonna choke Nanny because it's getting all over your dress. All over your dress, yeah. Look, <laughs> ah, is it good? Is it good? Do you see yourself on television? Hmm? Usually when you see yourself on a, a phone or something, you kind of go, hmm, that's weird. Is it good stuff? You are loving this fruit. That is so cool. Y'all get your kids in the kitchen, do something fun with them, and let them make a mess, and then just clean it up. We're not gonna throw it in the floor, we're gonna hold on to it, okay? We're gonna go back to some more music for y'all for a few minutes, and, and you know that we're gonna be featuring some of that great local music that you all love. And don't forget, you can check out the whole concert on YouTube, or you can go to my YouTube page and you can see Zanna and all her shenanigans. You can see her at the Waffle House, you can see her with the puppies, you can see her with her dog, which absolutely loves her and, and is crazy about her and very protective of her. You can see Zanna anytime you want to, just subscribe to our YouTube page. So there you go. We're gonna give you a little bit more music and we'll be back shortly. I feel good, I got my best jeans on, I feel fine, I'll call my baby on the phone, we're going down to Janie's, and watch them shoot a game of nine, Jackie Dunn will be there, in his rag top 59. Dash of my machine And I know every single line Yeah, Susie's got her dress on Hanging high above her knees And when she smiles for the night You know it's such a sight to see Southern city lights, wheels will turn, and the rubber's gonna burn. The glass packs are racking, the power play is screaming loud. We'll cruise the red dot parking lot and see who all is in the crowd. Cause I feel good, I got my best jeans on, it's all fine. I'll call my baby on the phone.
prayer, dear Lord, each day that I may do the best I can. For I need the light to guide me day and night. Blessed Jesus, hold my hand. Blessed Jesus, hold my hand.
Okay, you're going to get to see Zanna one more time. I'm going to take her right now, right here, because baby Zanna, we have figured, is good for about 30 minutes on TV, and then all the sugar and all the fun. And now, Zanna, listen, you want to tell everybody bye-bye? Can you tell everybody bye-bye? Huh? No, see, I'm too busy trying to find something else to eat, Nanny. Can we tell everybody bye? And we're going to go back to some music in a minute. But first of all, we're going to remind you that you can do just single cookies and you can let your children decorate just a single cookie with blueberries and strawberries and give it that Americana theme. And there you go. How simple is that? Xana, look at that. Is that pretty? But Mommy's already cleaned you up and Mommy would spank Nanny. Oh! <laughs> Guess what we just did? We just poured all the avocado out. Well done. Okay. This is live TV with a 10 month old baby. Your best planned. Is it good? <laughs> Look at this. Y'all, she didn't eat avocado. The last time I tried it, she spit it all over me and she hated it. She has proved that sight, texture, smell, they change because now she's eating avocado. <laughs> that is crazy. That is crazy, y'all. You never know what a baby's going to eat. Try to feed them healthy. Try to make them happy. Try to do it in the kitchen this summer with your grandkids. With your grandkids. This is my great-grandbaby, and everybody knows kind of the craziness I've been through. This child has been one of the reasons that I still smile every day. I still laugh every day. She loves her nanny. She loves nanny's cross. She loves to play with my necklace, doesn't she? She loves that. But she is such a precious joy and such a gift from God. Remember, every single child out there is a gift from God. If you are lucky enough to be a great-grandma and you think you're too young for it, just suck it up like I did and get in there. So she is loving this avocado. I can't believe it. That's crazy. Is it good? Is it good? I love you. She is approaching her one-year birthday. It is going to be in August, and maybe, maybe, if we can control her, we can have a little birthday get-together here. I don't know. It just depends. She's about to walk, and y'all know once they walk, your life changes forever. So we don't know how we'll do that, but we want to... Zanna, can you tell everybody bye-bye? Can you tell everybody bye-bye? Say, no, I'm too busy with my avocado. Can you tell them bye Mommy said bye-bye. Look, Mommy's saying bye-bye. Can you tell Mommy bye-bye? Can you do that tell everybody bye-bye? And then you and Mommy are going to go home so you can take a nap. And Nanny's going to do some more music. Is that cool? Is that cool? Thank you guys for tuning in to, to get to see our baby today. And I'm so glad you were with us for this portion of the program. We're going to go now to some more music because baby Zanna is maybe sleepy we actually had to wake her up to do the show so <clears throat> yeah it's nap time it's nap time let's don't throw that antique glass out the floor please all right y'all here we go back to some good old Dwight Sanford music <laughs> Limousine 
you left home, you told me You said that someday you'd be returning With a fancy car for the whole town to see Well, everybody's watching now And I guess you finally got your dream You're riding in one of them long black limousines Tears I watch as you ride by with a chauffeur at the wheel dressed up so fine. I'll never love another. I'll never love another It's 3 a.m. 
Yes, I'll bet they're singing in heaven tonight. They're gathered in on heaven's shining shore. I know the angels are filled with delight And mom won't be alone anymore I'll bet they're singing in heaven tonight Cause Jesus just called a fire Yeah, Jesus sure called a fine one home. I'm sad. Zanna has left the building. Zanna Jordan had to go home and take a nap. We did pretty good to get her through here about 45 minutes because, let me tell you, she was asleep when they got here and had had about a 10-minute nap, had to wake her up. So a good day was had by all, and she didn't pitch, cut, and fit. And so I'm so thankful, so thankful. Okay, I want to remind you, you can do this recipe, and you can decorate that, and then you can give the kids their own cookies and let them decorate it. And I just cut up some pieces of strawberry, pieces of blueberry, and then you just decorate it. If kids only like blueberries, tell them to put only blueberries on their cookies. And also, if you have a child who can't have sugar, you could use stevia with this, and you could make a sugar cookie recipe and replace it with that. And then you could also, if you have somebody who says, I, I don't know about the cookie deal. Okay, what about if you just do it as a roll-up, like we did for Zanna's breakfast? Because... Some people aren't even into cookies, but I love this one because here's my little smiling blueberry. So it's so easy, it's so simple. Something fun that the kids can get in the kitchen with you and do. Summer is upon us, and I hope that you're gonna get to spend some time with your grandchildren. I hope that you get to create memories that will last a lifetime. I think about every summer we lived in Orlando, and I was lucky enough to get to come up here and spend time with my precious grandmother. And she taught me so much in the kitchen. Many of the things that I do today are because of her. I'm very, very thankful for that. I'm very thankful for those memories. So get in the kitchen and create memories. That's what it's about. You know, um, yeah, it'll be messy and you'll be like, I can't believe I've got all this junk to clean up, but it's okay. It's fun and they enjoy it and they will never forget these memories. Now, will Zanna remember 10 months old being on TV? Probably not. But we will remind her often, you made your debut. She actually made her debut when she was only six weeks old. So, But again, just do a variety of cookies and let your kids do that. And um, it's easy. It's simple. Start with a basic sugar cookie recipe and then move from there. Now, we're going to end today with more of music by that man that y'all really like him. And I'm glad you do. He's, he's a pretty cool dude. A lot of fun, a lot of craziness. He is crazy. He has got so much going on right now. He is finishing his 57 Fords. Fords, did you hear that word? More than one, multiples. He's into everything, but he's excited because the studio music is going very, very well. So you're going to get to hear that. And when I was talking to Bob Reese the other day, I want to remind y'all there's going to be that great singing Saturday night at Hickory Flat Fellowship Hall. It, is, it begins at 5 o'clock, so that's really cool. You can get there 5 o'clock, 6 o'clock, 7 o'clock, be out of there by 7.30, and then still come to the fireworks and ball ground. The fireworks and ball ground will begin that night around 9.45, and they're doing it that night so there are no conflicts with the communities around us. So, so get out and enjoy that. We're going to take you now to more music by the man, Mr. Ella J. Everyone he meets, he stays a stranger. With every move he makes, another chance he takes. The odds are he won't live to see tomorrow. Secret agent man, secret agent man, they've given you. Faces 
place that you find A pretty face can hide an evil mind Oh, be careful what you say You'll give yourself away The odds are you won't live to see tomorrow Secret agent man Secret agent man They've given you a number And taken away your name Shadows lengthen fast 
rest Come home, come home, it's supper time We're going home at last